This November, Hospice of the Big Country is holding an evening of remembrance for World War II veterans and their families. Here to tell us more is Burt Williams and Keith Savage. Thank you for being here today. Thank you. And so tell me what you have planned for this event. Well, first of all, I wanted to say I'm a, a volunteer. I'm retired Air Force. Mm -hmm. And um, one of the agencies I chose to work with was Hospice of the Big Country. I didn't know it at the time, but now that I'm a member of that, they have a thing called We Honor Veterans. And what that is is any patient or client that is in the hospice uh, program, if they've been in the military, Coast Guard, Merchant Marines, anything, any length of time, they're entitled and we offer them a ceremony whereby them and their families, neighbors, church friends, we come and uh, people in uniform present them a commemorative medal, a certificate, a plaque to put on their door. Mm -hmm. It's a very nice, meaningful way to say thank you to those um, people that have been in the military. Now, each program ha uh, has to achieve certain levels of accreditation. So as hospice of the big country has moved up, mm -hmm. we ask ourselves, what can we do to uh, celebrate? And we wanted to do obviously something for veterans. And so we chose to do World War II veterans because they're getting up there. Yeah. Any World War II guy is gonna be 90 years old or more. So we uh, have a program, an evening whereby a movie and a, a catered meal will be provided to any World War II veteran. They don't have to be in hospice. Abilene, Taylor County, big country. If anybody has a friend, neighbor, church acquaintance that they know is in World War II, they should call. I think it'll be a very meaningful evening for them. And the Honor Flight, which is the film we're gonna show, Honor Flight's a program whereby throughout the country, communities, even states will raise money to fly the World War II veterans to DC where they can visit the memorials, including the World War II memorial, which ironically mm -hmm. is one of our later memorials. And so, uh, but the big country, I think four, five, six years ago had an honor flight, but for individuals that didn't have an opportunity as such, the film is an excellent way to connect with ones that did. I've seen it, it's very moving. So um, it, it's limited seating capacity. Mm -hmm. And so we, uh, we in, invite them to come with um, their family, children, children, things like that. Awesome. So it's not open to all veterans, but World War II definitely. I'm sorry, Bert, I didn't know <laughs> to steal the show. How, yeah. how important is it to have this evening of remembrance and honoring these veterans? Well, Claire, we think it's really important because of, I think Tom Brokaw probably said it best for our generation when he said in his book, the greatest generation was the World War II the generation, they and their families. And uh, we just see that as being a fading part of our uh, very, very uh, uh, wonderful history. And so uh, before we completely lose all of our World War II veterans, we wanted to have a chance to acknowledge at least those that we can reach at this point. So very important to us. Awesome. Great, yes. great event. And if you would like to come out for this event, it will be at the West Texas Rehab Center boardroom at 4601 Hartford Street on Monday, November 5th at 6 p.m. For more information, you can call 793-5450.